It's garage sale day. I had a special guest that was supposed to come with me. I'm a special guest, motherfucker. On his, yeah, well, Josh will be a special guest, too. Uh, but, yeah, so because of last night's festivities on the stream <laughs> and Josh winning the Florida lottery, in hindsight, he wanted me to pay $100 on a $30 ticket, and I should have done it, but I didn't. Uh, he won a thousand dollars. We're gonna go cash that today. We're gonna go straight and then left. We might uh, go eat at at Rainforest Cafe in Orlando. Who knows? Oh, that would be so awesome. Lord would be so mad. Oh wait. Oh, Cheesecake Factory maybe. I don't know. We're gonna go to the we'll see. World's Arts McDonald's. Yeah. So Josh for seventy-five cents. It's actually my seventy-five cents. So it's mine until he pays me. But uh, tablet for 75 cents, an entire tablet for 75 cents. Probably doesn't work, it looks oh, old, it takes the old cents. old charger, but for 75 cents, somebody will give us five to 10 bucks for it at the flea market, Josh knows all the all the people that deal in that stuff, so. Woo! But no games, they weren't partnered with the Wii games. No Rolexes here, No Rolexes. Um, you didn't find nothing, so we stopped at a estate sale. They have some Wii games that they're gonna bring tomorrow. How am I gonna get those Wii games tomorrow, Josh? She said she has a bunch of them. She's bringing it tomorrow. I'm gonna have to come back and look because because I need I, I need them. I need Wii games in my life. So I just stopped at another sale. They had Atari games. Sold somebody it. Somebody beat us to it. Somebody beat us to it. There's a lot of people trying to do what we do out here in in the 727. So uh, let me finish backing up, and I'll see you guys at that next sale. So I just spent way One too much money at this thing. sale. Josh tricked me into spending a hundred dollars. First item off, we got a pink uh, Game Boy, which looks mint, like uh, it was used once. A mint, a mint pink Game Boy. With the case. We got the ten dollars. I'm playing some Tetris. Original Game, Game Boy, Tetris. mint condition, ten dollars. Some. We got some Texas some Instrument games because Josh Atari, don't know what those are. PS1 games. You know, Bunch of PS1 games. Oh, hold on, wait, wait, but that's that. That's. These are. Yeah, we're gonna See, show the problem the is there was nothing amazing in the bubble bobble two. On bubble PC. bobble two on PC. We gotta look that Bust one up. Bust a move. Bust a move. That's like five Heart bucks. Shot. That's five. Probably Tetris. five bucks. And there's a spot. Where's, where's the ripped up? And the, the score of the day for PS One, which I'm surprised in really good condition. Ooh, yeah. Mint. Ripped those rage. They had, they had they had PS One games. A bunch of PS One games. Ripped those rage will be like 10, 15 bucks easy. But then the babies. Nintendo. All oh, those babies. Mario 2 and 3, Mario 2 and 3, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong Double Dare, Double Dare. Three oh, Stooges. Family Feud, Three Stooges, they all have manuals too. They had a Game Gear as well? What is this? I didn't see the Game Gear. Oh no, they had a Sega. Um, this, this, this guy was a tough negotiator. They wanted 140 just for the NES games. Which was too high. Then they wanted 50 for that without the PS1 games. I managed to get them to go, to go all the way down to $100. It was a hundred dollars. Yeah, I, I still overpaid by about 10, 10 bucks because I was adding everything up and what I wanted to pay. And I really wanted no, to pay no, 90. All the other game sellers were messaging him, so he didn't want to go lower. Yeah, all the other game sellers. So, so I, and then there's the glasses. Um, I feel I got an uh, okay deal. Uh, like I said. The, the, the Game Boys, I'll easily get 20, 20 to 30 a piece 30 out of a piece because they're, mint. they're in mint condition, so there's 60. That. Mario 2, Mario 3, I that's 20 that. each, okay. that's 80. There, there's there's the 100 right yeah. there, you know, yeah. and then what else was in there? We got the PS1. I mean, yeah, I, I need NES uh, stock. I got NES stock. I sold so. the case. Oh, uh, Josh sold the case. Oh, so, yeah, amazing score. We're off to a good start. We still got to go catch this Tico. I'm excited. <laughs> get hype. Let's see what this is one of those times and prove me wrong try and prove me wrong I just got this for five dollars Roy McGilroy golf this trades in for thirty dollars store credit just for the disc now you try and tell me you're gonna sell a golf game for more than that I highly think not so that was five bucks that was scary speeding in here speeding in here this was a this was a dollar this was this was three dollars because why not wrestling 17 we out here baby we we out here and uh, uh, we are gonna go do some surprising things today we got a special guest to pick up so I'll see you guys later special Woo! Nuts. pawn shop in the area just picked up Hercules for 50 cents that's going to over there yeah, get your money. oh wait did I say no, that it's not like I don't have to Super Mario Odyssey on the Switch was not 45, it was 25. Uh, Family Feud was $2, it was yeah, the wrong he got, one. He got, he got 
This place is normally expensive and you get Mario Odyssey. And uh, Mario Kart on the DS. I don't know how much that was, but he gave me a deal, I hope. Good deals all around. You better. Yeah. Okay, so we just stopped at Goodwill. Didn't find anything. We got a few more stops to make. Got a special guest to pick special up. Guest. And then, uh, yeah. It's very, very shiny at night. Very shiny at night. Woo! Just stopped at a pawn shop and picked up Despicable Me and Plants vs. Zombies! Woo! They're $2 each. Not to say Josh told me so. We just stopped over there at a garage and he's like, oh, they're from the flea market. They're from the flea market. And there's this one guy, uh, I think he's, he's either deaf or can't talk that, that well. He's, he, he tries to sign stuff to you. Um, and that's who is here. I walk up and he does one of these things, like he's jerking something off. He's like, mm -hmm. he's always messing around with me. It's, fun, it's funny. But uh, no, no, I'm being, I'm being serious. He, like, he likes messing around with me. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, nothing here. He said, well, he didn't say, but he motioned, no, nothing here. Anyway, um, so yeah, on to the next place. On the next one. On the yeah. Okay, so we're here. It's me. It's it's Josh, and it's our special guest. We have a special guest with us today. Uh, anyway, so look at this. He's pissed off. Look at this. We are here at the lottery office to cash. It says twenty times fifty. So Josh back there won a thousand dollars, and we are going inside of the Florida lottery office. To cash yet another claimer. Look at that. The new Monopoly jackpot. You can bet every dollar you got that every dollar Josh gets is gonna go right back into this game right there. Hey. Josh, Josh, could you try and make this money last longer than 30 days? No, we just have the one store. Okay, yeah. Make it last longer than 30 days. Okay, show the check. No. Show the check. That thing's still on the top of the roof of the car. Oh, yeah, we gotta get that off of there. Josh puts it, Josh grabs it off the roof of the car. No. There's a little thing up top there. You need to get that off. I'm just gonna show this part. Look at that $1,000 check. That you could have been in on, but you're like, no! Florida lottery. Who said no? What you got back there, Josh? You went, More money than you. Yeah, you're gonna get robbed. Put that away. He's just flashing it right next to a bank. Yeah, put that away, Josh. That's too large. There's your forty dollars I owe you. I'm holding on to your twenty because I don't want you spending uh, it. I missed it. But yeah, that's the forty years, right? Just stopped at a pawn shop and I picked up MLB the show 2K16. And not one but two copies of Mortal Kombat Complete Edition on the PS3. I paid twelve dollars for the three. And there's like a string of like five more pawn shops we gotta hit up. But I'll see you guys when we get to the next stop. These guys went a little bit too far out over the line. What, what'd you say? It's red and blue. I like, see the head of the like Yeah, I know that, that is true. So both physically and literally our sister company, or I should say my sister back there, uh, Josh, uh, bought some stuff for uh, Movie Wizard. No, it's not Movie Wizard. Because he's trying to compete with Game Wizard. It's not Movie Wizard. What'd you, what'd you get? Patriot's Day, which was a good movie. The Shallows. Jack Ryan and Lesby Cops. Woohoo. Did you take it anyway? Anyway. So, oh, hold on, let me, I'll turn on the car a second. So, I got this baby. This is a double pack. This used to be rare. It's not rare, much rare anymore, but it was worth paying $3 and change for. Well, Josh got some codes. Any good codes, Josh? New Independence Day and Central Intelligence. They both have codes. Okay, so um, we're, we're dropping our special guest off for the day. Um, me and Josh are going to head back to the store. This was a very long video, I think. I don't know. Sorry, guys, if it was. Anything you want to say to, to your fans that are watching? I didn't know I had fans, but all right. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, she says bye. Josh says bye. I'm going to do one recap clip from the store, and I'll see you guys there. This is what we got today out garage selling. We got all this. We got a bunch of Nintendo games, Mario 3, Mario 2, Donkey Kong, PS1, uh, a Game Boy, 
the Game Boy Advance, what? and I did buy some games. I traded them in. I got two hundred and forty dollars worth of store credit, and I turned it into a bunch more games that are going to go on the wall. I got forty-eight games that are going to go on the wall. I'll see you guys next week for another Garage Sale episode from Video Game Wizard. Woo! Okay.